Thank you, Kurt. Thank you. Thank you for the bow. I want to apologize, and I'm a little bit late this afternoon, too. I had two things I had to do to deliver a beer to the uh, table in the back. The bar was right busy. And then when I got to the backstage door, Steve Caprice wanted to buy one of my books. <laughs> and then he wanted me to sign it. So I apologize for being late. Uh, before, before I get into this particular show, I'd like to try to clear up a rumor about Elvis' movies, if I may. Everybody thinks that Colonel stopped Elvis from doing a star's part. That is not true. The role was offered to him, and the Colonel sat down and explained to him, Barbara Streisand is the star, her husband is the producer and director, John Peters. He says, if you want to do the movie, feel free to do it, but here's what's going to happen. He's going to make her outshine you because she is his wife. And Elvis says, well, I don't want to do that. It was Elvis's decision, not the Colonel's. So all these people that think Colonel stopped him from doing that, that's not true. So today, this particular movie show, I have to tell you, I'm from America, where Elvis is, where Elvis is history, he was born, his legacy. We have nothing like this. We do not have one Elvis movie show in the entire country. So Mike Noble has created something here that's awesome. Big screen, some small screen, and with great performers. So we want to continue now bringing you Elvis's most recent appearance on American TV, where he had an appearance with Celine Dion. This particular song was debuted on American Idol in 2005, and people are still sending in links to have you seen this. So if people are still discovering this video, and it is awesome. So please welcome back to the stage, Mike Noah and Amy, my dear 